Hello everyone and welcome to My Organized Life, where I'm trying to get my life organized. If you are new to the channel, a huge hello and welcome to you. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for being here. So today we are going to be going through and planning out the next week of June. So from the 7th to the 13th. So this would technically, for me, be considered the second week of June. Um, this is the week that we're currently on. So today is actually Thursday. I had planned to record this video yesterday, but um, things at work have been a little bit crazy and I've been working way more than I wanted to, but we're going to make up for that today. I've got a lot of recording to do. Pretty much all day is going to be recording. Same with tomorrow. So lots and lots of stuff to get done. So I use printable stickers and I bought all of my sticker kits for the year 2021 from the Design Sticker Store. Since I use one theme of stickers for the entire month, I do go through and make extra stickers and I sometimes edit them. So I'm just going to pop up a video clip showing you guys what the original stickers would look like if you did decide to buy this theme for yourselves. If you want to skip that though, I will leave a timestamp here so you can skip over that and get straight into the planning. Hello everyone, it's me from the past. So I'm going to show you the stickers that we're going to be using for the month of June. So I bought all of my stickers for the year of 2021 from the Design Sticker Store. Um, this specific set of stickers as well as her store will be linked in the description box below if you would like to check that out. So I'm not really sure if she's all printable stickers or just majority of what she sells as printable stickers, but um, I bought 12 different printable kits from her for each month of the year. And this month is called Serenity by the Sea, I believe. It is absolutely beautiful. So I'm just going to show you what you would get if you bought these stickers. And I like to do this because um, since this is technically just one kit, um, and since I use them for the whole month, I need to create extra stickers. So I like to show you guys um, the original stickers because I do edit some of the extra stickers. So for example, we have some... Uh, bill stickers here that are just this peachy coral color. So if I needed to print off like another eight or ten of these, I would probably change the color that way there's a little bit of variation in them and that way it makes it so each spread looks a little bit more unique. So anyways, these are the full boxes that's included in the kit. They are super gorgeous and whimsical. I love these. And then we've got some quarter boxes underneath in the four main colors that are throughout this kit. We've got some days of the week, some date dots, some little bow, I believe these are, they're not headers, I don't know what these are called. These little bow things that I don't usually use because I cut stickers out by hand, so <laughs> uh, these things are tiny. Um, and then we've got our bottom washi, so that is it for the first page. So the second page, she actually gives you two options. Um, I went with the glitter headers, but she also gives you script headers that have um, a bunch of different um, stuff. I will try to remember to put a picture somewhere around here um, of what the scripts are so you can see that. So on the top here, we've got these cute little sticky notes. Um, we've got these little half boxes, a weekly tracker. We've got some little dots, a happy birthday script, Etsy sale. Um, these little things, which I'm not really sure. I think these are like banners kind of. I'm not sure what these are called. A little decorative half circle, I guess. We've got a weekend banner, which I love this one. It's super cute. Um, we've got some appointment stickers. We've got doctor appointment, nail appointment, um, gas, and hair appointment. We've got a little bow and some script stickers. We've got planning time, recycling, coffee break, work, call, binge watch, cleaning, payday, groceries, happy mail, shopping, and laundry. And then we've got these beautiful um, washi strips here. There's a couple um, header size. And then we've got our glitter headers. And we've got some TV trackers, some meal trackers, um, some blank trackers, and some work stickers. So that is it for the second page. And then the last page here, we've got our half boxes, some pay stickers. So this could technically be used for payday or like a bill, I suppose. And then we've got these here, these quarter box weekly trackers. Um, we've got some heart checklists, some other little banners. And then here is the deco. So not a whole lot of deco for this month's kit, unfortunately. And I'm starting to go through and trying to choose which shop I want to use and which kits I want to use for next year's um, planning. So I'm a little bit more um, picky on what kits I'm going with depending on how much deco there is because I do really like the deco. 
Um, it's really nice to have on days where I don't have a lot going on, so it's nice to be able to fill up that space without using the same pieces throughout. So while this is a really nice for just um, one week's worth, if this was if I was using this for just one week as a normal like weekly kit, this would work great for me. But since I use um, this all throughout the month, um, just having a, a little bit of deco does not really work for me. So then we've got some full box heart checklists. We've got these cute little paper clips with bows. Um, we've got this little start doing, and I love this because it looks like it's tape, which is awesome. I love that. And then we've got this little flag banner here, which is super cute. So that is it for the stickers for June. So this is what you would get if you bought these from her. Um, no editing, no nothing. This is the original kit. It is absolutely beautiful and I love it. Um, and I'm really excited to start planning with this. So let's dive on in. All right, so welcome back. So I'm going to mention things as we use them throughout the video just because I never know what exactly we're going to be using. Some weeks it's different, sometimes I throw in different stuff. However, everything will be linked in the description box below. Everything from Etsy will have its own link and then everything from Amazon will be through one link that will take you to my idea list that's categorized in several different categories. So you can go through and browse through that if you'd like. A little bit of a disclaimer, it may or may not be an affiliate link, I'm not really sure. With that being said, let's dive on in. So one thing that I am going to use is my reversible tweezers. I may or may not have mentioned in my little video clip, I never really watched that. I I filmed that and then I edit it and then I kind of forget what I mentioned in it. Um, so just in case I didn't mention, um, the printable stickers that I bought were for Erin Condren kits. Since I use um, a recollections planner from Michaels. They don't fit in here quite perfectly, but they fit in here well enough for me. But I like to use tweezers for just a little bit of extra precision when laying them down. So let's go ahead and I'm going to put down the days of the week, date dots and bottom washi, and then I'll meet you back. that there. So I'm just going to close this up and we'll focus on this part here. I'm going to start with the dashboard as I usually like to do. So I'm just going to put this little flower up near June just to kind of decorate that up a little bit. And then I'm going to put this week sticker here which I'm not really sure what to do with this but eh, I might just put a two in there for June week two. I don't know. And then I do have my weekly tracker here just to mark off each day when I have everything completed for that day. That way if I've missed something, I can look here, see which day that um, has something left over. That way I can get that out of the way. I want to keep the dashboard fairly simple, so I'm not going to be putting a whole lot in it. I haven't printed off my cleaning stickers yet, so I'm just going to use this for now. So I'm just going to put this cleaning script above that. So for this week, I want to clean and organize the bookshelves in my art room. Um, I want to completely clean the upstairs floors, and then I want to declutter and organize the bedroom closet because it's a little out of hand. <laughs> It's a little bit ambitious, but I think I can get it done. We'll see. And then I'm just going to put this little bow clip here and I'm going to leave this for whatever I want to put there. I'm just going to leave it as empty space. So then moving on to Monday, I do work six to two on Monday. And then for the second job, I have the Instagram giveaway to do at seven. I love these little post-it notes. They're so cute. I am, you're going to notice that I'm keeping this week's spread very minimalistic and just functional. I surprisingly don't have a whole lot going on or maybe I just don't have a lot of deco in this kit to use as I normally would to be able to fill the space but um, it's going to be a lot of white. 
So on Monday, I like to go ahead and cut stickers for the next week's plan with me just to get ready for that. And then this is just a reminder that I need to make sure that this video is um, scheduled or ready to upload for Monday. And then not really much else going on on Monday, so I'm going to put a full box here and then a meal tracker at the bottom. That is it for Monday. So then on Tuesday, I also work six to two. For the second job, I've got the VIP group giveaway to do at four in the afternoon. And then I'm just gonna put this little work script up above that just to use up some space. I'm going to use a yellow glitter header here and then my Netflix uh, does need to be paid by Tuesday and that'll be for $15 and then I've also got a reminder here for um, uploading a cash envelope stuffing video. I think I want to offset this just slightly so that way it's not fully aligned with this one. So then we'll use a green glitter header and not really much else for Tuesday either. I don't plan a whole lot for the days that I work. I'm going to put a TV tracker here because I'll try and watch a show with the kiddo and then put a meal tracker at the bottom and fill in a little bit of the space with some deco. I'm just going to use this glass jar with some coral here and then a little starfish. That is it for Tuesday. So I do work on Wednesday as well, not a full shift. I'm just lunch cover for that day. So I only work a three hour shift from 11 to two. And then I'm gonna put a full box underneath that. Followed by a blue glitter header. And then I've got my foam bill comes out on Wednesday, so kind of like to offset this too, but I don't know if I'll have enough room. So let me just start from the bottom of this section. So um, I want to try and film the following week's plan with me. Then I'm going to use this planning time script right above that, and then we'll put in the foam bill. And bring it down just a little bit there so it's not completely aligned. I don't know why, I just don't like them being lined up unless that's what I'm going for. But not what I'm going for for this week. Let's put another header here. And then I'd like to start recording my color along for July for my other channel. So I'm going to try to record part one on Wednesday. And then I've also like to try and watch a show either by myself or with rain depending on how he's feeling and I don't think I left myself enough room here. This stuff needs to be a little more closer together. I don't think I'm going to be able to lift that though unfortunately. Um, Okay, so we got our meal tracker on the bottom. I do have a nail appointment on Wednesday. So I guess I'm just gonna go like that and have them kind of squished together. I still have room to write down what show we watch. Not ideal, but it'll work. Okay, so then Thursday, I have the day off. So we're just going to put a gold glitter header here. Okay, I'd like to set up and record my July budget spread for my budget binder. And then I'd also like to go through the two channels and reply to all of the comments. And put a little bit of deco in the corner and then a blue glitter header underneath. 
I did buy a full box and another glitter header because I don't want to, uh, I didn't want to overload this week with stuff because I know I'm going to be tired and I'm going to want to just rest and relax. So I'm just doing the minimal of what needs to be done. Um, I'm also going to be recording my July color along part two and recording the color alongs takes quite a bit of time. So if I'm filming one of those, I don't really like to plan for a whole lot else because I don't usually have time or motivation for much else after that. Um, it's not as simple as the videos I do for this channel because there is a lot of pre-setting up, getting ready for these videos. I literally just grab my stuff and start filming. But for my color alongs, I have to figure out the colors. I have to make sure that everything's on my desk. Otherwise, I'm constantly pausing and restarting because I don't edit those videos like I do these ones because they're so lengthy and it would take forever and I just don't have time. So I like to make sure that I am as set up as possible before starting. So I usually film for an hour and a half and then it usually takes me like an hour and a half between setting everything up to begin filming and then writing everything down and cleaning everything up after filming. So it's a little bit more tedious. So no work on Friday because for my second job I have the website giveaway to do. And then for my other channel I need to make sure that I've got the June Color Along Part 2 ready to upload. I want to put in another glitter header underneath under that. And then I want to film, edit, and upload my June Paycheck 1 check-in. And then we're going to put another full box under here. And then see if we can squeeze a meal tracker in here. I think I need to start working from the bottom up because I'm not leaving myself enough room. So let's do that here. I'm going to throw in a glitter header here. I'm just going to skip this box for now. Okay, so on Saturdays, I always work Saturday and Sunday normally. I usually always work the weekend. So I usually leave Saturday for um, editing any of the videos that I haven't gotten around to editing throughout the week. So um, that'll be the plan with me for the following week after this. And then the July budget spread. I'll be editing those. I'm gonna put this cute little coffee break sticker here. And then a glitter header. Throw in a full box because I don't plan a whole lot so I don't really have much going on. And then of course I do work six to two. So for Sunday, I'm assuming I work, however, I don't have the schedule for that week yet, so I'm unsure. It'll probably be 6 to 2 because it usually always is, but we'll find out. So this Sunday is laundry day, so I'm going to put this laundry script here and this cute little whale underneath that. And then I've got a glitter header and I need to remember to have these videos ready to upload for the following week. So the plan with me and the July budget spread. Put down a glitter header here and then a weekend banner. meal tracker here and then I'm just going to fill the rest of the space up with a little bit of deco. This is going 
nothing to bother me, so I'm going to try and fix these. My shaky hands. I've had a lot of coffee today. I'm gonna flip this upside down. These stickers like to. Curl up a little bit when I remove them. I can't pick them off with my nails, but I find if I use my X-Acto knife for work, which is why it's so dirty, so apologies for the ugly knife, um, the stickers will usually come up. So the spacing it was just going to bother me because everything else is somewhat in line except for these two days. So we're going to fix this one first. Okay, that looks better. And then we're going to fix this one. There we go. That is better. Okay, so now I'm just going to flip through my other stickers here and see if there's anything I would like to add. So, of course, I am going to add stickers to cutting stickers, and these ones that I'm going through right now are from the Print Petticoat Bandit. I'm going to put this little email here, that way, um, just as a reminder that if I have time after replying to comments, I can go through my emails. Okay, I think I'm going to put a little budget pencil here. And I didn't really leave much room, but maybe I can put a camera in. Put one right here. I'm not going to put one on this one, but I can put one here. Because that's recording. And then I feel like this laundry sticker is cute enough. I don't really need to add anything else to that. I do have these cute little hangers that I finally cut out. I think I'm going to put one maybe here, um, just by where I want to declutter and organize my bedroom closet. So that kind of works out there. So that is it for the Print Petticoat Bandits. Um, don't think I have any other stickers that I want to add. See if there's maybe something that I can put in here. I definitely would want to keep it close to the color palette, and I don't really have a whole lot that matches this. Um, let's see though, if I lift this up, there we go. 
so it can fit this in. It kind of overlaps this cleaning one here though, so let's lift this one up slightly. Okay. I don't know if I like that there. There we go. I think we're going to put it there. I like that much better. So that just gives me a little bit of room to write anything else throughout the week that I need. And it fills up that space. I like that. I feel like this still matches quite a bit with this. So I think that looks good. I think. I think we're probably gonna leave it like this because I don't really see much else for space that I would wanna fill in. So this is what the week is looking like. It's definitely a lot less cluttered than this week. This week is just crazy. I have so much stuff to do. I'm definitely looking forward to somewhat of a less chaotic week here. I think having more open space, it looks less busy and I think that will help me not be as overwhelmed as when I'm looking at something like this. It also helps that this is not payday week. Payday week is always quite busy. So this is what my week is looking like from the 7th to the 13th. If you guys like this video, would you please give it a thumbs up? And if you'd like to see more content like this, feel free to subscribe and ring that notification bell. But as always, I hope you enjoyed and hopefully I'll see you next time. All right, guys, take care. Bye.